The power system in Shaman King is something a lot of people take for granted from the series. In fact, I even took it for granted. This power system is so open-ended. I'm gonna have to make multiple videos going into more detail about it. So I guess you could say this video is more or less an introduction to it. Now shamans in Shaman King have the ability to call on spirits. And these spirits can range from a master samurai, a cheetah, angels, genies, gods, and even buddhas. These same spirits range from your regular ghost type spirits, to Sirei class spirits, and even Kami class spirits. To take full advantage of these spirits, shamans must create an oversoul. OS or oversoul techniques are what shamans use to fight with their spirits. This ability allows the spirits to take on a physical form. But these objects do not entirely exist on the physical plane, because it can interact with you, but you cannot interact with it. If this is hard to really understand or comprehend, think of it like Nen from Hunter x Hunter. It renders all conventional weaponry useless and makes normal means of fighting useless as well. After all, you're fighting a ghost, my guy. This is why Silva appears to be floating in the air, when in actuality, he is using an oversoul to fly. When I say just like Hunter x Hunter, I am not joking in the slightest. So you have to fight an oversoul with another oversoul, or fight Foryoku with Foryoku. Foryoku is spirit energy that they use in Shaman King to manifest an OS. Think of it like it's life energy. Outside of manifesting an oversoul, shamans are capable of using a technique called Hyoi Gatai. This is what happens when two spirits merge in the same body. A Hyoi 10% is nothing more than a spirit possessing your body. But, at 100%, the two souls are perfectly in sync. Anna says it herself, combining your soul is different from just a simple possession. Yo has the same skills as a master swordsman when he is possessed by one. But with the Hyoi 100%, when they combined, Yo was able to truly use these abilities for himself, along with his own personal skills. And outside of combining your spirit with yourself with the Hyo Gitai, you can actually combine spirits with other spirits. This is called a Shosai Gitai. So if Yo really wanted to, he could combine a Mitamaru with the spirit of Earth or even an angel. Again, I plan on going into more details in other videos to save myself some sanity and use some confusion with just how much there is to this power system. But to give you guys brief ideas on what exactly people in the series can do, you can make your oversoul into literally anything you want. Literally anything. One of the angels in Shaman King turns into an orbital satellite. A villain turns rats into Legos. And yes, I'm not joking in the slightest, this man actually takes rats and turns them into Legos. And then he'd use these same Legos to take the form of whatever he wanted them to be. You can turn animal spirits into guns. You can make people from an oversoul. You could do anything that you can think of. The possibilities are endless, and this is not including the special abilities that your spirit can already have, or the special abilities that the shamans have themselves. For example, Hal can take the spirit of fire and change its elements since he is a master of the yin yang jutsu, and he can reflect curses. These are all of his personal abilities while the spirit of earth, Yo's second spirit, can manipulate gravity, create plants and metals, and generally do anything a large landmass or the earth could do. And these are just all of his spirit's personal abilities. So not only can you make whatever you want with an oversoul, but you have your own personal abilities to take into account and the abilities of your spirit. And these shaman personal abilities can range from summoning any ghost that you want whenever you want it, reading minds, summoning shikigami, and so on and so forth. These are all spells that the shamans have learned themselves. And if you put all these abilities into one person, they're capable of having one of the most versatile movesets you could come up with. 